Good afternoon. We're in the Fig Greenhouse. It is September 21st. And we're going to look at a couple varieties here. That is called a Dom Mutante. There's nothing. They're about right. This is a low cordon tree. As you can see. There's one there's a fig that fell off its laying on the ground down there. Good sized tree, as you can see. This is all new growth from down there. It's a big tree. Also, we're gonna look at called a dom. This is called a dom Jacinantina. It's not quite ready. Getting real close though. We could let it hang, it'd be a lot better, or we could cut it, but we're, we're just gonna let it hang. That one right here, this is one we're gonna cut off here on Gigantina. Let's go ahead and pull it off. It's a nice low cordon tree. Already reaching to the top, getting some more figs. It's ripening. Oh, that there's real close. We'll put that in our tray. Let's see what this gigantina here looks like. Cut her open. Beautiful fig. Called a John Gigantina. Got a nice skin on it. Mmm. Never too sweet. Nice, rich berry flavor. Mmm. Wow. All right. Let's get these here off. Called a Dom Mutante. Looks like there might be one over there on Called a Dom Nori, too. Let's go ahead and grab one of them, too. Yeah. You like the looks of that. Now that's a different that's different it has a it's sweeter actually i think it's a little richer than the uh gigantina over here there's my bourgeoisie it's about ready mm, yep it needs another day here's my Call it a nori tree. It's uh, up over, well over 10 foot tall. I see one fig over here. It looked like it was about right. Mm. Oh, yeah. Now, let's, uh, now we're going to have all three of these compared to each other. Fairly similar. Well, let's see what the flavor is. Oof. I mean, like, these things never, ever, 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 ever disappoint. Mmm. Mmm. That's a nice cross between the two of these. Very interesting. Very thick, jammy. Mm. Hey, if you get a call to Dom to ripen, they're special figs. Try a couple. So, looks like the call to Doms are just on the money today. Here is another call to Dom. This is call to Dom Border Saltinka. And I got this tree here from Dan Foster. Dan had asked me. I point out some of these trees that I get from him sometimes. So this is a really nice, this is a really nice fig. And it is very well ripened. Uh-oh, I seen an ant coming out of it. That might be a bad sign. 
might not be good. It might be full of ants. Oh no, I see lots more ants coming out. Daggone it. Yep, let's see what the inside of it looks like anyway. We're already here. Huh, the ants didn't hurt nothing. Y'all have an ant once in a while. Ooh. Very well ripened Calderdom Bordesatinka. Here's the other piece. Mm, yeah. That thing. Wow. Really sweet. Mmm. Like strawberry jam. Holy moly. That's a good fig. Call the Dom Borda Sotinka. And what we got here is LSU brandy. Starting to ripen. It's got some, getting some cracks on it. Let's cut it open and look at it real quick. That's a really nice thick. LSU brandy. Let's go down here and look at the little tree that's off of. Here's my tree. It's a little five gallon potted tree. You can see it was a four by nine tree plug. Let's get some more figs on it. There it is, LSU brandy. Here we go again. See what it tastes like. Mm. Oh wow. Got a nice rich berry flavor with some molasses in it. That's really good. Hmm. LSU brandy. Might be worth having. We're gonna see.